Hello Hacktubers and welcome back to another video. 3D Metal Puzzle Kit by Macrop Colette Scavenger, which is crafted steampunk inspired model kit designed for hobbyists, creators and collectors. Combining a vintage aesthetic with modern engineering, this product stands out as a both a hands-on project and display world masterpiece. More info about Dune Meta Wasteland Punk Scavenger kit, you can find it at link below this video. Now let's see what we have in the box and must mention this kit have 331 pieces need to be assembled. The scavenger parts are metal components like all kind of bolts, hex nuts, lock nuts, washers, machine screws and many more types then design look of steampunk robot will be given with all these details using the metal parts. These components come pre-cut and shaped ensuring that they fit together with precision during assembly. The kit also includes the necessary tools making it accessible for beginners while remaining challenging enough for experienced builders. Ok, before start to assemble, take a moment and relieve the pressure using this rubber man which is included in the kit. Pliers and screwdriver are only tools that I'm gonna use for building the metal steampunk robot desk lamp. Let's start with step 1 and the assembly process is guided by detailed instructions that simplify the complex design. S6, W3, W4, Q4 and LS46 metal parts are required for assembling the step 1. Everything is organized in zip bags and all of them are marked with numbers and letters, so you can make a mistake. It's a metal puzzle that with every piece assembled you engage with the creation and enjoy while building. As I said, if following the steps from the manual and picking the right parts, the progress started. Right now I finished the step 2, 3, 4 and 5 and so far I made the left and right foot of the scavenger robot. The make robust scavenger is designed to provide a rewarding building experience. Builders can enjoy the tactical satisfaction of piecing together components, aligning gears and tight bolts. The process is not just about constructing a model, but engaging creative activity that stimulates focus and attention to details. These hands that are working are not mine, it's my 11 year son who asked me to help with assembling this futuristic wasteland punk scavenger. As he say, I love to work with small metal parts and make something that you will love it and will be great gadget on your working desk. I am at step 20, assembling the hands with fingers, wrist, forearm, elbow and arms. In this section I am making two of them, of course left and right. Just take a look at details with those fully articulated joints. Scavenger can be posed in countless dynamic ways, giving you the freedom to play with it and set it as you wanted. Many zip bags with metal parts waiting to be added to the creation. So far we are 50% done and that is pretty nice progress. We came to the part where legs are connected with torso and arms. And my son is doing a great job 
and by the way in the same time he learned the new metal parts he is very interested in design, engineering and art. This kit is amazing learning project for every kid or adult. The head of the scavenger actually is a LED light lamp and when it's finished the lamp will, be, will offer adjustable bright levels making it perfect for reading, working or simply creating ambient light. With adding the leather belt on skeleton, 70% of parts are used and you can see right now we have the, the whole body constructed and it looks like he is from the forgotten civilization. Now it's time for assembling the base, adding more details using shiny gears, bolts, nuts and washer to mention that Macro 3D Metal Puzzle is made from premium materials ensuring a satisfying assembly experience and stunning finished product. I am at step 55 when is used metal soft wire that need to be bent and shaped as is described in instruction manual. The diagram in the book is one to one size so you can be directly bent to fit the shape according to the length. After finishing the step with solid wires, next is assembling few more detail pieces that need to be attached to the metal base. Those shiny wires are giving such steampunk detail to the base something like power circuits so you can the scavenger work and stand perfectly on place. I am almost finished with the creation. I can't wait to plug in the USB light and see how it works. Two strong magnets will hold the whole robot in place and the last part is adding the cloak which is real fabric and such a great detail on scavenger. Congratulations to me and my son, we are finished with assembling the 3D metal puzzle kit called Scavenger, a wasteland punk gadget, which is a masterwork made from 331 different metal components. Scavenger isn't just a decoration, it's a functional desk LED lamp that can keep you company while you work. The USB cable is 2.6 meter long and adjustable brighter levels you can control the LED light. 
with fully articulated joints you can set the scavenger in many positions and giving you the freedom to display as you like. Now let's test the light and see some close-ups of the model. I really like this gadget and I love the way of assembling all the tiny parts. I hope you enjoy this video and if you like a kit like this you can check the Macro online store and get one for yourself or surprise someone for the holidays with a gift. Thank you for watching, that was all for in today's video. See ya!